okay so let us see what is there in this question now uh, the molar mass uh, of the ideal gas is capital M The molar mass of the ideal gas is capital M and a fixed mass of small m of the gas expands as at a constant pressure P. The graph shows the variation with the, the temperature capital T of the gas volume V. So Vt graph is uh, given, to you, given to us and we need to find the gradient of the slope. So as I have told you in many other questions, whenever we want to find the gradient of the, of the graph, we have to compare, we have to create an equation of a straight line and we will compare it with y is equal to mx plus c. So in this equation, uh, because we are using ideal gas, so ideal gas equation will always be there. PV is equal to nRT, where n is number of mole and R is universal gas constant. So it can be written as, the number of moles can be written as small m divided by capital M into R into T. So now, Pressure is constant, so P is constant, and because V is taken on Y axis, so I am substituting V as Y just for the clarification. So it will be P into Y is equal to small m by capital M into R, and T is on the X axis, so I am substituting X in place of T just for the clarification. So now y is equal to m into r divided by capital M into P into x. So comparing this equation with y is equal to mx plus c, which is the um, equation of a straight line, we can always jump to the conclusion that the intercept will be zero and the slope, this slope, the gradient or you call it gradient will be equal to mr divided by m into P. So D is the correct option from A, B, C, D. This is how we do it. And as I have told you earlier many times now that whenever we are having a straight line graph, always try to create an equation which can be compared with Y is equal to MX plus C to find whatever you want. So with this, this is Professor Varun. All the best. Bye.